Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've recently installed the latest Windows 11 update, you might be noticing something weird happening with your system's performance. Specifically, an issue has been identified with update KB5067036. Which is OS build 26200.7019, causing a major headache with how Task Manager behaves. Let me open the Task Manager and see what is happening. The problem is that when you close the Task Manager using the standard X button, the process doesn't actually stop. It keeps running silently in the background. Close it a few more times throughout the day and you suddenly have multiple instances of Task Manager hogging your CPU and RAM. It's a definite bug, but thankfully, there are a couple of quick ways to fix it right now. The easiest and most direct workaround is changing how you close the task manager itself. Now, instead of clicking the red X in the top right corner, go over to the processes tab, scroll down until you see task manager listed under apps or find taskmgr.exe in the details view. Right click it and select end task. But what if you already have several instances running? You can use command prompt to clear them all out simultaneously. Click the start button, type in command, and right click on command prompt in the search results. Select run as administrator. In the black window that pops up, type in this exact command. Hit enter, you'll see a message that says, success, the process has been terminated. This instantly kills all hidden task manager processes running on your system. Microsoft is aware of this and has likely issued a fix through what they call a known issue rollback or KIR. For most home users, this fix happens automatically on the back end. The best long-term solution is to make sure your system is up to date. Go Windows Update and hit Check for Updates. Installing the very latest patches should permanently resolve this bug. A quick restart after checking for updates might also trigger the automatic fix to apply. So until Microsoft rolls out the full official patch, stick to those two workarounds. They should keep your system running smoothly. If you found this helpful, smash that like button and subscribe for more tech tips. Let me know in the comments if this bug was affecting you. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.